the system is tough now because so many people have been brought into the system. Uh, when I was a child, we were taught that 90% of all scientists who have ever lived are alive today. And it's probably still true now. Um, maybe it's an even higher percentage, I don't know. But quite aggressively, a lot of young people were recruited to biomedical research. And for a long time, the NIH budget in the US doubled and doubled and doubled on a regular schedule. And then suddenly it flattened out. And there was necessarily a lot of competition and a lot of attrition. People brought into the system had expectations that they could become PIs, and not all of them will. The system won't bear that, and it's only uh, a fact of life. It's not something we can necessarily uh, argue or legislate our way out of because society can only afford to devote so much to science. Maybe we wish it's a little bit more or a little bit uh, more than that, and uh, yet <clears throat> we, we have to realize that all resources are limited.